Good morning everyone to the respected principal, teachers and all my dear friends. I am glad for this given opportunity. I would like to share my thoughts and my understanding about Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. Look at the sky. We are not alone. The whole universe is friendly to us and conspires to give the best to those who dream and work, says Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. First, let me tell about him. I am proud to be born in a country where he was in India. He was born on October 15, 1931 in Rameswaram, Tamil Nadu. He was the 11th president of India. He served our nation from 2002 to 2007. And he worked with organizations like DRDO, Defense Research Development Organization and ISRO, Indian Space Research Development Organization. And he was intimately involved in India's civilian space program and missile development efforts. For its efforts in missile development and launch vehicle technology, he came to be known as the Missile Man of India. He returned to a life of education, writing and a public service after his term. And he got uh, several awards, the, which is one of which was India's highest honorable award, which is Bharat Ratna in 1997 and Badma Bhusan in 1981 and Badma Vibhushan in 1990. He learned to play Veena and wrote a poetry in Tamil. And Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam's birthday was marked as India World Student Day. We remembrise a few reasons why former President Kalam was an absolute favorite. Promoting religion, tolerance and interfaith dialogue. He was a Muslim. He read his daily namaz due and fasting during Ramzan. He had been strictly instilled in Islamic custom in his children and he was grown up and improved as a young Kalam. And the value of interfaith, respect and dialogue, he valued human emotion. But he fondly said that for a great man, religion is a way of making friends. But small people makes it as a fightful, fightful. Humility and refuse to accept BBI treatment. At a function at IIT Varanasi, when he was invited as a chief guest, he was refused to sit on a chair which was specially offered to him. When the missile man told to sit on it, he refused and, and took a notice and he humbly offered the chair to the universal official instead, inspiring young minds to dream and fly. He, can, he was conferred a loving little of Kalam Chacha, Uncle Kalam, and uh, he will because he will receive hundred of email a day from young people, young people who is inspired inspired by his encouragement, dream, 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 believing in democracy that is functional, and fifth one is inspiring change even after learning. Leaving office in 2012, he launched a campaign called What Can I Give a Movement to develop a giving attitude in the youth and to encourage them to contribute towards nation building by small but positive steps. Let us hope that a few teachings of law, the late President Kalam inspire us to make a better India. Thank you.